you know like you cannot wait for the result of one conference to focus on another conference that's not the way you do it so you need to speed up the process Welcome everyone to week 12. This week I don't have much to say. I'm still continuing the literature survey conference paper which I was uh, I talked about last week. See the information card on the top right corner. So you know like you cannot wait for the result of one conference to focus on another conference. That's not the way you do it. So you need to speed up the process like uh, there are one I focused on one of the research questions. I mean one of uh, part of my research in the last week's uh, it's not last week. It was the like one month back I submitted for a conference and now for this conference which I talked about last week I am focusing on another aspect of the research so i won't waste much of your time because this week i don't have that much to share but i will just keep it very short like maybe two minutes or four minutes so i'm still continuing that literature survey with another research question and luckily as i think i mentioned it last week the deadline has uh, increased uh, to i mean they have extended the deadline for one more week so i have a lot of time and uh, now the new deadline is uh, 19th of uh, November to submit the paper for the conference. Its, its name is CSCL, Computer Supported Collaborative Learning. I'll leave the link below. So in case you work in collaboration or something similar, maybe we can collaborate or maybe you can talk with me and we can share each other's experience and uh, see how we can help each other. So it's the same that I'm still continuing the paper and I think I mentioned the short tip last week that how can you squeeze in a lot of references by giving a separate link uh, in another Google Sheet or something like that. Uh, check my video, uh, I plead you to check my video to uh, last week so that you can know what I did in that the shortcut to squeeze in more references just like a journal and also a conference paper and uh, talking about this paper i also uh, i think one or two weeks back i mentioned about reviewing papers so uh, that is also very nice like if you have some experience of reviewing papers and that's the reason that in the cscl they are using the precision conference solution mostly you will see every conference top tier conferences use easy chair for their submission but Precision conference solution doesn't use easy chair, so they are using something like uh, precision conference solution. In that, they also ask some uh, submission authors, even though you have never s published in the CSCL, uh, you can volunteer to maybe like review some papers depending on your wish maybe uh, doctoral consortium or conference papers or short conference papers anything you can uh, I mean like volunteer so what I did personally just to get uh, used to this reviewing process and also to know how the review goes on because my paper is also there in the loop so I submitted for voluntarily to review two papers that was my wish to review two conference papers and probably uh 
after like uh, the submission is over after like one more week they will assign the papers to the reviewers so probably i'll get two papers and maybe i don't know if they'll give me full conference for both so maybe they'll give me one full and one short paper that's how they assign for new reviewers who volunteer they don't want to hamper the quality of the reviewers and yeah so next week towards the beginning i think it will be as per our time it will be tuesday in the morning the deadline is there for this cscl paper and there's one more thing like i'm really anxious for it that uh, i'm going to hear the news of uh, the previous conference paper that i have submitted what happened to it uh, let's see fingers crossed hope that it gets accepted but you never know like uh, it may go anyways depending on the theme of the conference and what kind of reviewers are assigned so uh, anyhow whatever be the news i will uh, keep you uh, informed with some of my experiences and my stories so for today it will be very brief and uh, as i was always busy with writing papers i've repeated this multiple times so probably i'll share more next week depending on how good or how bad the news of the decision is and some of my experiences throughout the week so see you next week till then peace